Over the past quarter century, the level of inflation in the United States has been consistently low, pretty much irrespective of the level of unemployment. Investors, however, are becoming concerned about the possibility of higher inflation rates in the future, fueled by the degree of fiscal and monetary easing that we have seen in the U.S. over these past few years. During the 1950s and 60s, it appeared as though during periods of low unemployment, inflation rates would rise higher. Then, the so-called Phillips curve that describes the relationship between unemployment and inflation went haywire during the 1970s and 80s, when the country experienced a period of both high inflation and, at times, high unemployment rates. But since about 1994, the country has seen the opposite. There's been more of a Phillips pancake, with a completely flat relationship between inflation and unemployment. This poses a challenge for central banks like the Federal Reserve because it makes it difficult for them to know when is they will need to tighten policy. How far can unemployment go down before inflation rates start going up? And the answer to that question is something that nobody really seems to know.